This playthrough is rated M for Mature. Greetings and salutations, viewers. Volomar back here with another episode of South Park, The Stick of Truth. In the last episode, we explored South Park, trying to figure out where the rest of those antenna were for that the, that the visitors gave in to us to teleport around for a bit. Then we met the Goths to try and get them to join our team, bought the outfits, and we were going to get them to join our team, and then we were ransacked by the Vulcan, or Vulcans, by the Elves, and we were forced into a battle that we could not win. Actually, I could have just escaped and let them beat me, but I wanted to find anyway because i could and now the elves the drow elves led by kyle the hydra uh, druid a jewish elf has dictated that i should get the goth kids for them should i betray the fat ass himself cartman to join the elves they haven't really hurt me they kind of just let me go instead of joining the wrong team but cartman has uh it's cartman let me play and uh, i mean he's insulted me but he doesn't I mean, hasn't done any obviously ill will decision decisions but let's kind of mess around for a bit before we do anything else. You know Hello? what every good bot should have? A flute. If I had a flute, I could play fantastic melody. If I only had a flute. My Facebook says the rancher might be selling one. You know where the ranch is? I'd love to see if I could buy that flute. Huh. Sounds like a quest. Haha. -ha. Oh, by the way, we've got two new companions. Let me see if I can uh, pop it up. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We have an ability from last episode that I forgot to buy, so... Uh, before we go anywhere else, let's see. Uh, now flip two stacks. Of, ooh, two stacks. Wait, that's pretty good. Steal HP. Or inflict extra damage against stun targets. Oh, that's pretty good as well. So you mug him. And if you have enough PP, actually, then you could use a power potion and then execute with that. That would be pretty good. Especially uh, for strong enemies or possibly bosses that are not immune to... Well, most bosses are immune to stun. But there's a few, like... Strong enemies that aren't. Hmm. Yeah, a lot of good combinations. Uh, let's go with backstab because the two stacks of bleeding sounds pretty good. So anyway, uh, <clears throat> all right, our party can now consist of. Okay, well we can't choose. Okay, for some reason, we'll... for some reason, it doesn't show the look of them. I guess we have to leave. But uh, anyway, we have Stan who plays a uh, warrior. Stan follows the way of the warrior, relying on sharpness of his wits and sword. Stan's trusty animal companion, Sparky, can be called into battle or commanded to pee on certain obstacles. So you got marked for death, discus of might, whirlwind slash, and way of the sword when you read it to level 10. And then... <coughs> <coughs> yeah, excuse me. Jimmy the Bard. Jimmy is a bard, a master musician and entertainer that can bring boons to his allies and curses to his foes. Outside of battle, Jimmy can be commanded to access special bardic access shortcuts. Uh, you know, it's power chord, song of buffness, lullaby, and uh, the brown note at level 10. Uh, bards are pretty awesome in D&D. &D. Uh, they get kind of the shaft a lot of times, like people make fun of them, but uh, they're pretty good. They're pretty good support. Hey, you want to go to the ranch? So. Maybe I can finally get that, get that food. Okay. Well, we'll do that eventually, Jimmy. Calm down. Hey, don't, Kyle. don't let Carmen use you. Oh, okay. Fine. All is lost. My contacts, my maps, my friends list, all taken from me by the She-Ogre. She has no soul. You will help me battle the Shiogre and reclaim my iPhone? Perhaps you are one to be trusted. Very well. Let us end this. Shiogre, huh? Who's that? That uh, sounds pretty dangerous. And he took your iPad. Ooh. In the world, of, uh, the world of modern day, if you, if your, if your uh, phone is taken away, you know, hell has no fury like a uh, uh, kid's ability to need that. Okay, so we get a weapon called the Poignard, or. Poignard, yeah, yeah, that's Poignard. I was about to say, maybe it says Poignard, just because South Park, but no, it's Poignard. That's not too bad. Penetrates armor, so really good. Actually, is that for us? Oh, I forgot to grab it. Yeah, power potions are full. Actually, it almost sounds like a... Uh, for it being a uh, penetration, that sounds like it might be a, a thief weapon. Yeah, it says for stabbing. Penetrates 25% of armor, uh, starts bleeding on a perfect attack. That might be, uh, hold on, let me, uh, oops, yeah, there we go. All right, and then, let's, uh, let's equip that. That actually sounds like, uh, sounds like a, a thief weapon. Okay, so we want to equip, ooh, and it's got two slots, even better. Let's see, 20 damage to attack, uh, draining tw from bleeding targets, that'd be pretty good. Shock. Remove shield, that'd be pretty... Man, there's a lot of good abilities in this game. It's hard to decide which ones to use. 
Um, they have to be bleeding for that to work. But that would be, you know, stab them and then, or you do a perfect attack would obviously bleed too. Uh, let's do that and the cult one. That sounds pretty good. I mean, I probably won't need the healing part of it, but, uh, ooh, blade's all bloody, or, uh, but all whatever now. Any hey, ally dude. of the Elf King is an ally of mine, and my shop is open to you. I'm, I don't know if I'm technically an ally yet, but, uh, okay, we'll buy your stuff. Ooh, Elf Blade. That's probably for a warrior. Raider's Blade, Harbinger, uh, Sword of Endings, Longbow. Might buy that. Actually, I probably will end up buying just every weapon in the game anyway, just for completion's sake. I uh, see a longbow. An ineffective toy until someone thought to pair it with real arrows. Okay, we'll, we'll buy back. We'll buy the weapons later in the game whenever we actually hit those levels for that. Let's see. Ooh, we can also buy bard clothes. The minstrel's gloves. A pair of drum major gloves. Minstrel's cap. A flamboyant headdress of a great showman. And brightly and, uh, the minstrel's uniform. Brightly colored to light everyone, let everyone know the shows are right here. That's not bad. That, that sounds like a support a support outfit. All right, flare. I could. Wait, is it? Yeah, I'll buy some more later. I say flare for later because a lot of stuff times you can just get for free from places. Ooh, that's pretty good. Tax the norm to thirty armor. Wow, that actually might be better to uh, equip to my weapon. Let's see, and then we get candy bar wrapper. Let's see. 25% combat. That's really good. 10% uh, more bow damage. If I use bows a lot, that'd be good. And 10% more one-handed damage on my weapon. That wouldn't be bad either. And we'll buy that one whenever we hit the level. Ooh, Jason. Jason is a friend. Let's break some more shit. There. Ah! Whoop. <laughs> Our king may trust you, but that doesn't mean I have to. Oh, that's fine. Ooh, another safe trap. I think that's the final safe trap, if I remember. Yep, you get Timmy as a friend when you uh, find the final uh, fast travel route. Timmy! So nice. Terror! The humans have raised banners around town claiming elf territory for their own. So saith the Well of Insight. Plus, it's all over Twitter. The Well says balance can be restored only if a chosen one were to fuck up their banners. Does that sound like a quest? Sounds like a quest, so we need to fuck up the banners of the humans, huh? Uh, Dog Poo is Kenny's older brother, I think? Something like that? Anyway, yeah, now we have a lot more quests to do, so yeah, we could kind of mess around for a bit if we want to do that. Oops. And the sort uh, Well of Insight, obviously a reference to Lord of the Rings. Most stuff here is reference to Lord of the Rings. But if you got to reference something, that's a good one. Too bad most most modern fantasy... Well, okay, mom, a lot of fantasy does owe its look to Tolkien, which is a good and bad thing. It's kind of... Ooh, Elvish Loyalty Patch. That's not bad. So I'm gonna take those um, because a lot of the reason it's good and bad is because bad because a lot of people have basically use the same exact formula as Tolkien to tell their fantasy stories. So I mean, it's it's nice that there's at least some open source license stuff to basically say, hey, you can use elves, orcs, and, and all this without having to free no, reign. Anyone can do what they want. But uh, hello, nope, no talking. You're just a generic dude. Fine, you're just generic. All right, and let's get... Oh, I thought there was a chest up there. Must have missed Saw. All right, let's go down. All right, before we recruit the goth kids, let's uh, take care of some of the side quests for our new friends, apparently, that we have. We could... I'm going to fast travel here in a second. I'm just going to check the house because I don't remember... <coughs> Who do I want to keep in my group for now? If you want pure... Pure damage stands probably the way to go. If you want good uh, support, probably uh, Jimmy's the best way to go. Grab all that. Grab a. Oh, I also got a. I just quickly. It was another patch. So, cash dreidel popcorn necklace for uh, for uh, Moses and macaroni pictures. Moses's favorite thing. Yeah. Did you know that Moses is a fan of macaroni pictures? Apparently, at least according to South Park. Because I don't think we could originally go into. Uh, Kyle's house, so now we can uh, steal all this stuff. Thanks for letting us into your uh, click, uh, uh, Kyle. Now let's, let's steal all your stuff. All right, there's his Chewbacca mask on the top from his uh, from the first Halloween special, where everyone dressed as Chewbacca. Um, I forgot what the statue next to it 
that is looks like a toy plane or something like that or not a toy plane like a spaceship but i can't tell uh juice scouts uh let's see i'm more juice scout stuff a guitar where he tried to play a guitar once for a girl named kelly i think it was and they only appeared in one episode they were just like homeschooled people uh there's this pet elephant uh books about juilliard uh basketball where he wanted to be he got a, a was it negroplasty or whatever it was called in uh uh south park where he basically uh, because he thought if he was black he'd be a better basketball player or something like that yeah south park does that anyway see ooh, more underpants excellent i think that's the uh, yes, underpants, that's cool. yeah we got him all right nice actually hold on let me check something really quick can we now uh nice can we now change our party back to our old players if we really want to yeah, we could if we really wanted to. You would think with me being part of the elf... Well, okay, not officially joining the elf factory. You would think they would, they would uh, block these guys off for now. But no, we can keep playing. Uh, let's switch Let's switch to Jimmy for a bit. Stan, Stan can be pretty funny, but I like Jimmy. Remember when Jimmy used to be a jackass? Yeah, very few people did. <laughs> Juice Scout Guide, Cyborg Bill. I just got done playing with my Cyborg Bill doll. There's Einstein with the tongue out. I forgot when that would became a thing. Like those start popping up everywhere. Yeah, whenever we run into the underpants gnomes, we'll have all the underpants for them. The weird thing about this game is like being able to collect all this stuff for side quests that you haven't even gotten yet without even realizing it. Canadian adoption papers, because Kyle's uh, brother is uh, Canadian. Ooh, garage key for this. Let's gonna check in there. Cash. All right. Cool. Cool. Let's see. Ooh, barbarian wig. Now we can look like a barbarian. Bar, barbarian, b b barbarian. Anyone remember that cartoon? Actually, I, I hardly watched it. Apparently, a lot of people thought it was pretty decent for being a. I think it was a Disney cartoon. So up on a rope, Mr. Hanky's construction set. Let's see. Ooh, acne. Uh, Ike's chewing tobacco. That was when he was given. I think, like, steroids or something like that, and he grew up faster, so he was talking, you know, I was like, you're way like a teenager, basically. All right, let's get a free shit out of the way. Um, oh, by the way, by the time I've, uh, uh, by the time I've recorded this episode, yeah, I've already, <laughs> I've already played and beaten the, uh, the new South Park game, uh, Fractured Butthole, uh, with the superhero characters, and I would have to say, most excellent, if you like this game, pl how it's played so far, if you want a game with a bit more polish, uh, more about the superhero identities of the characters with uh, turn-based uh, grid combat, similar to like tactic, Final Fantasy Tactics, and you'll definitely enjoy it. And I'm not being paid to do that either. Have you I'm just... seen the new Taco Bell yet? Incredible! But I just really like the game, so I just want to let you know that I enjoyed it. So if you like how this game is playing so far, then you'll like it too. All right, what's what we got? Ooh, another chip Pokemon. Come on, get Pokemon Stigmata. Anyway, Kyle's Mutton Chops, oh yeah, from uh, when they played, did the Helen Keller uh, Broadway play, and a small magnet for getting more money. Although really at this point, I think I've got a decent amount of money, although I don't have so much money that I'll never have to get any more money, because there are some expensive things in the game, so. Alright, now that we've gotten there, let's look at the map. Where are we? Okay, let's see. Ah, the she -Ogre. Okay, so we need to go over to Stan's house. Wait. Stan's house? Why would there be a she -Ogre there? Oh, I see. Oh, well, if we're going to do that, let's switch to uh, Stan then for this one. Since I assume since I assume we'll need to uh, use him for this. I forgot if we could enter the Marsh's house already or not. I don't think so. Or, I mean, I think so, just not certain rooms. Yeah, the door is open, so we have been in here before, but we need to go into... I have a strong I have a strong idea of who we're going to be fighting. Nothing can prepare you for this battle. If I die, tell the guys I fought bravely. Kind of weird you're giving me a personal quest this early in the game for just... Oh, yep. We have to fight Shelly, Stan's sister. Down on that side where my parents sleep, and across from that is the cave of the She-Ogre. Ah, uh, Shelly, the, uh, the very aggressive teenager who's not sure to control her emotions because she's at that time period. Oh, no, that's the parents, right. So this one is Shelly's room, right? Uh-oh. Be prepared. Give me back my iPhone, demon! 
You little turd. I've brought help. Let's see you try and take us both. Ah! Oh, God. A teenager. The worst type of enemy. Ah! Hormones. Your days are numbered, Shiogre. All right, we need to beat Sheila. Let's check her stats. If she's got any weaknesses. She's immune to stun, which makes a lot of sense. Okay. Whoops. Don't need to summon. Can't summon anyway. So, yeah, like all bosses, if we have it, let's see. Got power Dude, potions. What is the yeah, we got strength potions. Let's go ahead and use it. Why not? We have it. I mean, I'm not going to go out of my way to buy those, but uh, hey, we're finding a boss. Okay, so we, since she's immune to stab, or uh, stun, so let's see. What does she have again? Is she... She doesn't have any, oh, she, ooh, she's got a lot of HP. Okay, we're gonna have to, uh, uh, oh, you know what? I should have used a, a shit nugget on her. Oh, well, let's get some bleeding on her so that way we can actually get a, um, uh, 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 some sta uh, status ailments on her. All right, two stacks now. Okay, what can you do? Mark for death, you can swap. What does that one do again? Oh, defense down, nice. All right, what's his abilities? Let's see, curls a, a deadly disc at the target, can chain to random enemies. That's be probably Mind better if, if you're fighting. While we're waiting here? <laughs> this is probably while we have to, uh, probably if you're fighting random enemies, that's a better ability. Hello? Let's see, that hits multiple foes, but we're only fighting one person. I mean, might as well use it. All right, mash X and then press square when you see a light. Okay. That's not bad. Oh, it gave even more bleeding. Uh-oh. Ow. Ow. Well, that sucks. Oh, right. I can steal her attack up if I mug her, despite the fact that I sh... Uh... Can I just take my turn? I'm going to steal her attack up, so... <laughs> and I stole a video game from her. All right. Can you just keep using... Mark for death. I mean, might as well, right? Yeah. Let's you get somewhere you'd rather be. Kill. All right. Oh, does he have a? Oh, can't use it because there's no. Oh, right. I don't have enough PP. Gotcha. All right. Die, you disgusting winch. Yeah. Not doing too bad. All right, let's throw a shit nugget at her so we can get uh, gross damage out. Should have done this earlier, but where is it? Can I just take my turn? Did I get a shit nugget or? Oh, I didn't check the toilet, did I? I did it, but didn't actually grab one. Yep, I'm stupid. Anyway, okay. Let's see how much. Uh... Oh, she's got quite a bit of bleeding to go, so let's be? just. Uh... And because I have that gain healing while I hit a bleeding target. Yeah. Nice. Haha. -ha. Not, not too bad, actually. Let's just keep. I mean, it's a free attack. It's a free, a small amount of damage, so. So I don't see why not to keep doing that, you know? Okay. Uh oh. Ah! Cherry Bros! She, she, if you didn't see, she threw a tampon at us. Okay, the human body is a gross thing, you know. And I'm not saying you shouldn't clean up after yourselves. Just don't throw it at other people. Come on. All right. Yeah, let's just keep hitting her so we can heal ourselves back up. I think my mom did a pretty sweet job with my costume. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Wow, she's almost out. Take this, you she ogre. I can do this all day. Take mine iPhone again. And I shall bring justice swifter yet. Get out of my room, turd! It's like we beat the crap out of her because she's got a black eye and bleeding. Yeesh. Talk about taking LARP too seriously. But either way, we somehow beat Shelly. I'm glad to call you friend. Wow, we somehow beat Shelly despite the fact that in almost every... Oh, we got him as a friend for doing that. But in almost every joke and iteration, usually Shelly beats the crap out of everyone. Like, that's the joke, but somehow we did it. Apparently, we are awesome. 
What did you say? Oh, Timmy says, Timmy, the Shiogre is no more. All elves can walk the land of Marnie and safe once again. I wonder if we could go talk to her again after that. Um, oh, we gained a level as well. Oh, yeah, I forgot to check my... Uh, see if I want to swap out my bow. I think I do. Oh, yeah, it's got two... Uh, let's see, let's remove that really quick. Oh, did I remove it from all... Let's see. Oh, I did. Whoops. Okay, well, let's... uh. Let's modify that again. I, I, I accidentally pressed the wrong button when I was, uh, let's see. What was it? The demon sticker and then the healing for bleeding targets, I think. Do I want to keep that or... Because you had gross damage, too. Or ignore armor. Although, I, that's more something if I'm aware of, like, what I'm actually going to be fighting, that would be good. Unfortunately, I'm not that, uh, not that much of an expert on this game to say, oh, this person's going to be... Um, able to do that or whatever. Wait, what? Oh, there it is. Okay, okay and then let me... Uh, let me quit the longbow. Since that's... And we can just put the fire on if we really need to. Uh, ooh, we can do frost damage, too. Let's see, what's the... There's also one for doing... Wasn't there one that... Oh, I maybe I didn't buy that ability yet. Let's see. Um, frost. Actually, let's see. Fire gives an obvious damage, and so does grossing out. So we'll just add those two, because those can possibly gross out slash burn a victim. So I'd rather do that instead. Okay, anyway. All right. Now with that out of the way, let's switch to Jimmy and go do his quest really quick. Oh, I think we also gained another uh, perk. Yep, okay, let's see. Stunt targets take additional damage. When you access to steal from an enemy, you can restore HP. Uh, or execute foot damage against stunt targets. Hmm. Might uh, do mug because that, redu or that restores your HP. Ooh, that would be bad if you up, upgrade your execute to level 8 gives you attack up too um, let's uh let's start upgrading mug okay anyway let's go fast travel in the house and go uh go to the ranchers we already fought the uh super bad cow creature from last episode I think but uh although we found out that was an actual cow and we killed it whoops but it's fine it's fine all right. Uh, okay, there we go. I think there's a fast travel close to the. Uh, yeah, there we go. Oh, and what's? Oh yeah, the nonconformist. I don't need to. I already bought all the goth clothes. We still need to do that, but we will need to do that this at the by the end of this episode or next episode, depending on how, how much. Uh... Oh, let's see. I got a message from Stan. Sparky just took a shit that looks exactly like Cartman's head. Kyle likes this. Cool. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, I forgot I was going to do so. I was going to relook up the... Oh, you know what? I think I could have done that at Stan's house, too, now that I think about it. Oh, there's the dead cow. Oh, boy, the cattle ranch. We're here. Excuse us. Hello? Hey, get off my ranch! Sorry to bother you, sir. We are elven warriors of the forest. I understand you might have a, f a flute for sale. You want to buy the flute? It just so happens I'm a level 10 bard, and a flute is just what I need to play magical songs of enchant... of enchant... Magical songs of enchant... A flute is just what I need to play. A flute is just what I need to play magical songs of enchantment. Of enchantment. Magical songs of enchantment. Of enchantment. A flute is just what I need to play magical songs of enchantment. Of enchantment. Magical songs of enchantment. Magical songs of enchantment. Of enchantment. Magical songs of enchantment. Of enchantment. A flute is just what I need to play me. A flute is just what I need to play magical songs. I can't believe how long they just drag this joke on, you know. Magical songs, Vinci. Some reason it doesn't get it doesn't get old. I don't know why. Oh, I know what I'm supposed to do. A flute is just what I need to play magical songs, Vinci. Oh no. Yeah, well, the only problem is the flute's in the barn, and there's where the crazy cattle are locked up. 
damnedest thing I ever saw. Some of the cattle started acting real funny. I, I tried to calm them down, but they shouted something in German and, and then tried to kill me. Well, don't worry, Wait, sir. What? You just need to help from a level 10 bard and his warrior friend. Leave it to us. All right, if you say thief. so. Here's the keys to the barn. I'm a thief. Thank you, Jimmy. Okay. D defeat the Nazi zombie cows. What? You're Sounds like something out of a bee movie. A flute? Damn foolish, you ask me. Oh, we finally can enter the barn, but yeah, sounds like a, a C, uh, or I was about to say B, but I think it's even less than like a C movie horror film or something, you know, like, All right, you know, Cass, killer condoms from space type of thing. What the? Looks like we got a fight on our hands. Well, it looks like my Ger uh, looks like if I have any German viewers, they're not going to be watching this because uh, you can't show stuff like that on uh, German girl. internet or Sharing TV or whatever. No for a hero like you. Which I can understand. I mean, you know, when you have such a bad... Although, funny enough, I could just probably summon and take out one of the dudes, but... Yeah, we'll have uh, fun with it. Okay. Um... Uh, oh, we have stink bombs now. When do we get that? Oh, right. I have... That's right. My level went up, so now you can do uh, that. Oh, sorry. Let me check my... Let me check all the stats. I mean, the gross, they're weak to fire, so I do have the... At least I have the bow that can do fire damage. They can't be grossed out, but... Although they don't look like they'll be too tough, though. Maybe for what it looks like, anyway. Eh, let's mug one of them. Let's see what a cow... What does a cow own? Uh, well, sorry. An undead... Or a, a zombie Nazi cow. Thank you very much. Glowing goo, huh? Alright, Jimmy. What's your abilities? Alright, power cord. What does that do? Eyes on the apple. What did that do? <laughs> I'll have to look that up because it does. You can't check it on on your thing. Okay, we got song of buffness. Weakens enemies while making the party stronger. Preventing them from taking turns to take damage. Ooh, I like that ability. Close your eyes, no more thinking about thinking about your troubles. Sleep now with Jesus, for you are blessed. Basically, it's a uh, band hero. I mean, or, you know, guitar hero for all intents and purposes. Alright. Now, let's just keep... I don't think I've shown... Uh... I don't think I've shown... Uh... I don't think I've shown this ability yet. Whoa, where did that flail come from? Yeesh. An amazing feat of skill. Oh, it raises our it raises our PP use. Oh, that's cool. All right, let's uh. <laughs> I guess I guess the idea of being able to use the German speech of Hitler must be open license if anyone if they're using it. Actually, who would be who would be crazy enough to own the own the rights to frickin' uh. Um, uh, the, uh, I assume it's one of the things that's like open license for historical reasons because obviously what? despite Enemy. everyone to the contrary that thing that it actually happened in real life you know that type of thing well that's the case I could just keep putting them to sleep sleep now the whipper wheels are dancing gently now put your mind to rest Wow, what a terrific audience. Set him up and knock him down. You know, it kind of makes sense that he would be... Eh, I should have checked this. Oh, wait, no, they're immune to gross out. Nah, I'd rather not waste it than if we're going to... If it's going to be like that. Time to warm up the cramp. Actually, Jimmy is a pretty good... Uh, pretty good... I mean... Uh, Jimmy or Butters, because Butters can heal you. Not himself, though, which is sad. But but, but the fact that you can restore your PP is not... I mean, yeah, there's items that could easily do that, too. But but when you really think about it, that's pretty... That's not a bad ability. Oh, he's kind of... Whoa! Oh, he just... He just kamikaze does. Huh. Well, all your cows are dead, dude. I don't know what else to say. Cash, health, well, shine boots. I forgot what episode that references. 
I don't remember everything from South Park. Cash and Nazi armbands. What are the, what are those in Germany? I've, well, no, I think they use instead of the swastika. I think they swap it out for like the official Nazi flag or whatever it is. I think because yeah, you can't show like Nazi symbols on German TV or movies or games. And it's almost. Although, you know, I'm not gonna comment about what another nation like does does or doesn't have or whatever because I don't live there. So how can you get over there? Huh. That's interesting. Because it's clearly a box that you could get for uh, items, huh? Well, that's interesting. Can we... Ah, fire! Oh, right, uh, okay. Woo! There, ah, the flute! Hooray! We got it! Way to go, Jimmy, we did it. I guess we gotta return to the rancher. Now, how do we get... Hmm. There's no, I don't, I don't think there's a teleport around here, is it? Well, because look at that, there's clearly an item there, but I don't see a... Hmm. Am I missing something? Because there's no lights in here to, to fart on. Let's see. I, mean, I don't need to get that, but that's kind of bugging me now that I think about it. Is there a... Let's see, there's no alien program here, is there? No? You should leave the comedy to me. Hmm. That is gonna bug me. Well, I guess I don't need to get it. It's just the fact that there's a treasure chest there means that somehow you can get it. Can't go around... Can't go behind the stacks? No? Hmm. I better move on, otherwise it's just gonna... Let me double check, see if there's... Can I knock off the wood? I have no idea then. Maybe that was there on purpose just to be dicks... Maybe to be dickish to me. Alright, let's give the rancher the flute so we can officially get it for ourselves. I got your flute. Hello. Hey, you did it! You elves were pretty alright! Did you find the flute? I sure did, Rancher Bill. And now my bardic abilities will be greater than ever before. Well, you earned it. See you around. Thanks, new kid. I couldn't have done it without you. Where should we go next? Who knows? But we get Jimmy as a friend for completing that quest. Ha ha! The bard is our friend now. All right, looks like we helped our two new companions with their little jobs, which have earned their friendship to us, which will help us in the long run of the game. But there's more for the new kid to do, many more side quests, and getting the goths on our side. But we still must decide, who will they join? Cartman the fat-ass grand wizard, or uh, Kyle the Jew elf? Find out next time what I do in the next episode of St South Park The Stick of Truth. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.